Libra, things are looking really good. Drop your sun, moon, and rising down below. Hit that like button, subscribe, share this video. Check out your sun, moon, and rising videos for a deeper look. But let me tell you something, Libra, financially, because I did a bunch of love readings already earlier this week, things are starting to come together. Valentine's Day is right around the corner, and you could be telling me with this nine of baskets and the six of coins, you done took a risk on somebody, or maybe you've made some financial risks starting a new business, applying for some positions here. But this is you hitting the jackpot, getting the win, the finer things in life. We see a passport. We see a basket full of money. We see books. We see jewelry, wine, bread, the best type of food, carbs. The six of coins, earth energy. Um, this being a card of taking a risk, taking a gamble, and either way it going, it working out in your favor. That nine of baskets just confirming that. Okay, Libra, this month is going to be looking good for you. And whatever it is that you're going through. Ooh, and you got somebody watching you from a distance. Now, this could be a new love offer coming in from somebody watching you. Seeing that you're doing good or getting all that good, those good vibes from you. But this could also be for you financially, Libra, that somebody's watching you in the workplace or watching you in your industry and getting ready to make you some type of financial offer that's going to set you up, okay? I'm getting very rich auntie, very rich uncle vibes here. Okay, Libra. Dang. Libra, ooh, the seven of knives in the reverse. Now, this card speaking in the upright of somebody being a liar, a cheater, a thief, being underhanded, stirring up the pot here throwing stones and hiding their hands. But in the reverse, this is the truth. This is somebody who may have come off shady and underhanded that's getting, that's watching you, that's getting ready to make this offer to you and leveling up. Ooh, this may be an, an unforeseen business partner or this is somebody that you thought was shady or whatever that's getting ready to come forward that's watching you. Getting ready to come forward and present you with something. Could be love, could be a financial offer. Another seven here, the seven of sticks in the reverse. This is you being able to let your guard down, your defenses down. Ooh. And what I'm really getting here, Libra, is you've really been working on something. You've really been working on something, putting your blood, sweat, and tears into it, and it's getting ready to work out. So this could be a relationship that you poured all into and you thought that this person was being shady, but really they were watching you. Getting ready to present you with something. The mother of knives, more of your air energy, Libra. This is Gemini Aquarius energy. This is somebody demanding the truth, setting some boundaries, getting ready to lay down an ultimatum here. And this is also somebody who has proof so this is somebody watching you. You thought they were shady. You got some weird vibes from them, but they're watching you. Getting ready to present you with something. They were taking notes, making sure that you were who you said you were to present you with this offer. And the eight of baskets here in the reverse. This is walking away from people, places, and things that are no longer serving you. And Libra, you could be telling me that it is you that is setting these boundaries and walking away from people, places, and things that are no longer serving you. This nine of baskets because you're doing better now, because you've leveled up. Because you don't need any of the nonsense anymore while you're on this journey of leveling up and getting these rewards. Let's get into the Son of Knives. Who's watching you? I feel like it's this person in the Seven of Knives. But who's watching Libra right now? Mm. The Four of Baskets. Which speaks to somebody being focused on all one thing instead of all the other things that are being placed in front of them. So, Libra, I'm getting that you know exactly who's getting ready to present this offer to you. And again, I feel like you got some shady vibes or you weren't sure about this person with the seven of sticks, seven of knives, maybe even pushing them away, setting some boundaries between you and them. But this person is serious. And they will have some things that they want to say to you. Ooh, watching you from a distance. Now they want to tell you some things. And they've only been focused on you. The Miss Ida here, which is the high priestess. This is the keeper of the secrets and knower of hidden knowledge. But those, that hidden knowledge is getting ready to come out when I see this in the reverse. Ooh. Ooh. 
the big house or a tower moment in the reverse. Now the tower, let me move my camera so we can all see this. The tower or a tower moment is some type of crisis that shakes up the foundation of a relationship or the foundation of a situation here. This in the reverse is almost like a welcome change. These secrets are welcome. This person letting you know that they've been watching you and that's why they've been acting funny because it could be somebody that you, maybe you have a shop or you work somewhere and you see this person watching or staring or you know this person is whispering about you or asking about you. That's because they're impressed. So if this is work, money is coming in. If this is love, you're about to be in a really good financial and spiritual, emotional position here. Let's get into this big house. What is coming your way? What is coming your way? What is this? The free man that came out just like this. And this is starting a brand new journey. Either way, this is the full card. Starting a brand new journey. And then I feel like this is going to put you at some type of crossroads with it coming out that way when it flew out of the deck. Give us one more for this free man, this, this brand new opportunity here. And we see it, the finer things in life here with this nine of baskets, the six, the six of coins. You could be telling me that it is a very rich man or a very rich woman that is getting ready to come your way. That's been watching you, keeping an eye on you. Mm. Yes. The daughter of baskets. This is a love offer coming in. You may have had a secret admirer, Libra, that is getting ready to not only bring you the love and opportunity that you want as far as that, but also some financial stability to the table. This may be somebody who wants to move in with you and really wants a serious relationship. The seven of knives being clarified by this five of sticks. Fire energy, Aries, Leo, Sag, action. This is somebody's... This, this card speaks to gossip and people talking behind somebody's back here. And maybe that's what you thought that this person was doing. Being messy, being nosy, all in your business here. But this person was researching you so that they could come forward and ask you something. The five of coins, another five. The five of coins, which speaks to an abandonment. Let me pull it up. An abandonment, a betrayal here. But this is the opposite of that. You may have to abandon and betray old things back to this eight of baskets, walking away from old things to allow these new changes to come in. See, three fives is um, changes, angel number five, five, five. Because if you don't walk away from those things with this six of baskets in the reverse, it's going to be blocking these blessings, the proposal card. Do that. So you're going to have to walk away from some things to allow this to come in. So Libra, you could be telling me that you have other lovers waiting in the wings here. And you got to let them go to accept this new person. Or maybe you energetically are still wanting um, to deal with somebody in the background. And here it comes. Or maybe it's just the way that you're doing things that you're going to have to walk away from if this is all business and all about money here. Because with this temperance energy... Patience, harmony, balance, equal give and take here. If you don't walk away from certain things to allow these new blessings to come in, whether this be a person, a new lover, new money, new job, you're going to be draining yourself or not giving yourself a fair chance and to receive everything that this new opportunity has to offer you. You have the moon underneath the seven of sticks, releasing this defensive energy feeling like you have to protect yourself. Because whatever this was that was going on in the dark here, or this gossip or these secrets, or you feeling like this person was entertaining other things, no, the truth is getting ready to come out. And this moon is masculine energy. And we see that this older man is holding this young boy close to him. Again, almost giving like, this person comfort or they have your back here. You don't need to fight this person. <sighs> Gemini, excuse me, Libra, you have the lovers, Gemini energy, Pisces with the moon, Gemini with the free man, Gemini with the courting cards, Scorpio here with the big house. For some of you, and this came out for um, Gemini as well, that your divine person is getting ready to show themselves. This and the fact that these people are in black and you can see these two people here watching them, 
You could be telling me that this person has been keeping you a secret or you've been keeping them a secret. Because maybe this person stood out above all others here. But this speaks to, again, the secret admirer of this person watching you. Getting ready to present you with this offer. Aquarius energy here with the grandchildren in the reverse. Now, you could be telling me with this pa, that older man holding that younger child here, that it is there's that there is an age difference between the two of you. Maybe this person has grandchildren. But this is wish fulfillment. This is a divine blessing coming in. And just because it's in the reverse doesn't mean that it is negative. This to me is something that you just don't see coming. Maybe you didn't think that this person was even interested in you. Maybe again, you thought this person had some type of shady or underhanded intentions here. No, no, no. They're getting ready to present you with an offer here. The seven of baskets. Because you have many opportunities, other, many other people, again, money opportunities that you could be choosing. But be aware of the deception and the illusion. Make sure that you're reading the fine print. Make sure that you're asking all the questions here. Don't be afraid to ask questions. The six of sticks to clarify that. This is getting the victory, getting the win, big Leo energy, being celebrated, getting the rewards, getting the accolades, somebody um, being excited to have you in their life or excited for you to, or maybe you're recited, excited, excuse me, to receive this person and these offers that are coming in. Another six. We have the six of baskets, the six of six and the six of coins, and we have the lovers. Somebody please drop what 666 is in the um, comment section. That would be amazing. The mother of knives being clarified by, boom, the marriage card. Boundaries and ultimatum here. This person is going to come in. And if you're not already courting this person, because maybe you were courting this person, you felt this person wasn't saying anything. Like they were shady and being underhanded here. This person was trying to play it safe. Because what I'm getting is they have very deep feelings for you with this moon card. Very deep feelings for you. They're not entertaining anybody else here with this for a baskets, and that's the secret. They may have been acting like that, and it was an act to keep you on your toes in an effort for them to try to keep some type of small level of control because they have these overwhelming feelings, and they are trying to set the solid foundation with you. This is somebody who's going to come and give you everything that they can possibly give you with this nine of baskets, taking this risk. And I do feel like there's an age difference between the two of you, Libra. Maybe somebody's older. Maybe somebody's younger here. We see this ten of sticks. Because you may have thought that you were ready to end this with this 10 of 6 because the way somebody was acting here. Maybe you felt like they were keeping you a secret or, again, courting other people here with that lover's card being next to this. But no. No, 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 no. This is just the beginning. Libra, you have the 9 of coins here. Virgo energy. This speaking to somebody being strong and independent. Focus on their bag. Focus on their money. So for those of you that this is resonating only for financial and not love. You have been working hard on all of this and somebody's been watching, taking notes, making a list of everything, your strong suits, noticing that you have very few weaknesses in the workplace and getting ready to reward you, leveling up, getting that bonus, getting that major promotion, maybe something you didn't even see coming here, a business deal, contracts coming in. But for those of you in love, this nine of coins is you being single and independent and not quite sure with this 10 of sticks if you're ready to be in a committed relationship here. But I see this that this is a very smooth transition here and almost natural with the six of knives and another six. Six is having to do with choices and an imbalance here. You have choices and options. The big mama card underneath that big Leo energy right next to each other. The six of sticks and the big mama. This is comfort. This is home. This is the most positive card in the deck. This is um, happiness, triumph, because you've been working hard, manifesting this new love, manifesting these, this new money coming in. The grass being greener on the other side. Fertility. For some of you, this is the person that you're going to start a family with. Happy in endings, excuse me, and brand new beginnings. And that's what you're walking away from. It could be your old life with this eight of baskets in the reverse. A welcome walking away here. We see this manifestation with this black Herman in the reverse, which is the magician, which speaks to somebody, you having all the tools necessary to be successful in a given situation. And I see that this is in the negative, not because there's manipulation and deception at play, not with everything else that I see here, but that you're nervous about accepting this offer or nervous about walking away from these things, these things that are familiar with to you with this eight of baskets.
But with this Father of Sticks here, this is you taking a bold action. Boldly moving forward, boldly stepping forward, boldly, boldly accepting this. We see this wine here, this fruit, this blessing that is coming in. We see this wine and this food here. You know, I prefer carbs. Carbs are in this nine of baskets. I almost feel like, Libra, you're going to be blessed in many different areas right now. And it's going to either start with work and then come in, come as a love offer or start as, lo as love. And when you become happier, your vibration is going to change and everything is it's going to have like a domino effect and bringing in all this. This is a major transition and a change here. We see that with the Scorpio energy here with the death card. This is also your angels guiding you through this. We see that with the angel number 666 in the building. We have the, um, do we have three fives or am I just making that up? I think I'm just making that up. Um, but you're changing and it's time for you to walk away from things because this is a transition, a transformation, one door closing so that new doors can open for you. And with this Empress card here, again, speaking to a balance and abundance, Taurus Libra energy, somebody being beautiful, creative, abundant, emotionally balanced here. And again, we see this fertility card here with the big mama starting new. And then we have this big queen here with a child in her hands. For some of you, this is the person you're getting ready to start a family with. This may be the start of financial stability for you and your family here and you're very nervous about that i see that here with this nine of knives but trust me when i say that th this is all good things this nine of knives is in the reverse taking the stress out of this situation let's get into this nine of baskets six of coins let's see if we can okay the ace of baskets in the reverse. This almost to me makes me feel like you were getting ready to give up hope on that you could have this or that this opportunity was going to come. And then here it is presenting itself. And this to me is also the minute you give up hope, all these things are going to come into place here because you may be going through a test. We're, we're just still feeling that mercury retrograde. You may have been being tested, and in those Mercury retrograde readings, people were definitely being tested this last month. This is you passing, getting the rewards here. We have the Mother of Sticks here at the bottom of the deck, underneath this Five of, or excuse me, this Six of Pentacles, taking this risk. The Mother of Sticks, the Queen of Wands, is a warrior queen. She is beautiful or handsome, you know, whether you're male or female, a very attractive, attracts a lot of attention on her game, all about her money, getting her school done, getting it together here. This was you thinking that nobody was watching you, that when you wanted to get attention, you weren't getting it, but somebody was secretly watching you and taking notes here. You could be being single and you're wondering why, why the hell nobody's approached you. You may be very intimidating to people, Libra, and that's why they haven't approached you. But this person is getting ready to come out and completely change the game here. They may be older than you, and I've been saying that. I've said that a couple of times in this video here. They may be, there may be an age difference between the two of you with this father of coins. And I'm not getting that this person isn't financially stable or emotionally stable here with this being in reverse. I'm just getting, again, that this is a secret. This person's watching from a distance. You're going to see this is going to completely come out of left field here. Completely coming out of left field. And you showing up here with the Dr. Buzzard, the Justice card, in the reverse. See, this is the scales of justice tipping in or out of somebody's favor here. So again, this could be this person that you were suspecting that was doing something shady or you don't know what was going on with them getting weird vibes. They're watching you, getting ready to bring in this abundance and this balance to the situation. You may have been worried about your finances and whether or not it's going to work out or whether you're going to be able to pay some bills or get some things done or go on that trip here. You will. Things are getting ready to change for you. 
you're coming out of this three of swords, this betrayal of the heart, or going through this heartbreaking period here, not knowing what's going to happen next. Again, where you're going to go, what's going on here. And then you have the strength card, big Leo showing up here. This is you having the strength to persevere and go through this. You have been tested and now you're getting the rewards, Libra. Rewards all over the place. Brand new opportunities here with the Son of Sticks. Brand new passion opportunities, new starts, new starts in love, new starts at work or in finances here. But be careful of the snakes in the grass with the Son of Sticks in the reverse. That you're not being presented, that you're not taking the wrong offer that's presented in front of you instead of the offer that's meant for you. Again, ask those questions, carefully vet something. Make sure that it feels right with this child keeping their hand out. Libra, this is nothing but good news. Drop your sign down in the comment section, your sun, moon, and rising. Do not forget to check out your sun, moon, rising readings. Hit that like button, subscribe, share this video. Check out this person's readings as well to get a deeper insight into them or the situation. And Libra, I will be checking in on you soon. Keep it real, family.